Hot ones, hot sauce. Hello, hello. Welcome back to our channel. We haven't posted in like a while. Over a week. Yeah. Yeah. Been a little busy. Oh, I was about to say, we haven't done much. Oh. Well, you start school, there's that. I've been busy. And I've been watching a lot of dramas, and then we also started watching a drama, so we've been doing that a lot lately. And I thought it would be fun to vlog today because it's Super Bowl day today. Woo! That's why he's wearing his jersey. Let's go Niners. Yeah, so we're actually running around picking up food right now for our friends and us to eat later. So we have food while we watch the game. Yeah, hopefully... Niners win today. The uh, Kansas City Chiefs are a good team, so kind of kind of scared, but I stay faithful. You know. Forever faithful for the 49ers. We have a good team too. Our team's really good. And a little exciting news. So yesterday, I don't know if any of you guys watched the previous vlog, or I think it's the third one talking about our Tahoe trip where we were talking about how some of our stuff got stolen. Yesterday, we randomly got a call from this lady who also had some of her stuff stolen around the time that we had our stuff stolen. And she was like, someone found her purse. And it was also attached to like some backpacks and some luggages. And basically what happened was whoever stole our stuff tossed it in the woods somewhere on top of a ski resort. And then like it was buried under, in, uh, buried under snow. So they dug all that out. So we have to go pick that up soon. So we're gonna go back to Tahoe. So we they found both our backpacks, but unfortunately it's no jacket, no laptop, no camera. That's like to be expected because people probably usually keep that stuff. They just tossed everything that they didn't need. So we have to go pick that up soon, which mm -hmm. is exciting. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's crazy to think about like how the stuff got on top of the ski resort in the woods and then it was buried under the snow. I heard there was a snowstorm though. You told me there was a snowstorm. Yeah. That's, that's just kind of crazy to me, like, the coincidence of people finding it under the snow and then, you know, giving her a call and then giving you a call and then... Yeah, because then when we got our stuff stolen the, and the lady that was like two cars away from us got her stuff stolen, we actually exchanged numbers in case we got uh, information and we can like contact each other. So that's why she was able to call me. We literally thought that the backpacks and the purse and everything was just gone. But they found it. Apparently a mom and her son were like skiing at the resort and they skied past it and they saw like her purse strap sticking out of the snow. So the son decided to go there and like dig it out. And while he dug that out and pulled that out, he saw like something else underneath, which was our backpack. He took that out and then he saw the other two luggages. We don't know who the two luggages belong to. Very lucky. Yeah, and we also don't know what food we're getting right now. So we're trying to decide. We have to text everyone to see what they want to eat. But I know for sure that I want to go to Bodine's to get a salad to eat later. And yeah. Or oh, coffee. Or oh, coffee? Yeah. Yeah, we'll go get some coffee. Maybe get some boba. Okay. Maybe we'll do that. We'll see. So we're going to text everyone now to see what there is to eat. Please leave your message for off. four. My dude's Anthony, why? <laughs> he doesn't want to be bothered. The other place is not good either. Hey, brother. Where where are those Vietnamese sandwiches from? Bun Me House. Bun Me House. Where is that? Yeah, it's near Anthony. Okay. Near Anthony's place. Alright, cool. Portola. Portola? Okay. Mm -hmm. I would yeah. suggest... Calling, at, calling ahead of time and ordering. Okay. Cool. Thanks. Yeah. So right now we have decided on Vietnamese sandwiches near Anthony's place. The same ones that we ate during Christmas party. I'm going to grab a salad. We have to pull a cash to get it. Mm. And then we have to go call them, order it, and then pick it up. I ended up getting brown sugar matcha latte like I usually get. It's not focusing. Right over there, brown sugar matcha latte. And we also got this Asian chicken salad from Bodine's. 
So Anthony got him coffee, that's why he doesn't have a drink yet. And I don't know why, but I've been really into Asian chicken salads recently. Have you thinking this just looks really good right now? It's What's like in there? peppers, almonds, chicken, cucumber, oranges, lettuce. Yeah. And it's only like nine something, which is really worth it because it's like pretty big. Yeah, so we realize that since Anthony is picking up the sandwiches. We don't really have anything else to do before the game starts now. Oops, I just missed my head, my bad. Let's put this away in the refrigerator. I popped it before I mix all of it. Now I have to stir it like this. What is the name of the place? Of the, of the meat sandwiches. Bun Me House. You heard of that? They all really like that place, so if you're in the city, go check it out. Bun Me House near Portola or something. Right? That's right. I'm pretty sure if you just type that in on Yelp, you can find it. Yeah. Or Google it. It was pretty good last time we had it, but I'll let you know again. After I have it again, yeah, we'll show you when it when it comes. Look, Bosa, Bosa, nice. Alicia brought the hot ones, hot sauce. <laughs> They're trying it now, and this is the sandwich. Yummy. You look like a farmer. <laughs> Never there watching and eating. Yeah. They're so close. Well, they got the first out. They got the first out. So they're gonna make it probably. Ah! Oh, 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 he got it. He got it. Damn. <laughs> I smell it. I should have had no. You're a. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> 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 I like it. Yeah. It's kind of smoky. It's for. That's all. Which one is this? Last dab? No, I would try it. Is it hot? Okay. You gonna try it? Try it. Nope, go ahead. It's good. Where's my dough over here? Nothing is spicy. That's, that's less than I've had. I've had spicy. No, I don't feel like it. So when you put it in the dry bark one? Yeah. Don't spice, don't spice. I'm trying to get it on my toe. You feel it a lot better if you get it in your eye. <laughs> show us. Show us, show, us how, show us how it's done. Let me tell you right now, you're not wrong. Okay. <laughs> it's not that bad. It's really good. Not, you put all a little. I know, but I'm, I'm saying like this spice. Very, very enjoyable. <laughs> <laughs> you see what I want? Almost? 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 It kind of tastes like curry. Really? It doesn't taste like curry. It tastes smoky. It tastes, yeah, kind of smoky, like just super peppery. Okay, so it's kind of dark. We're in the car now, going to dinner, but we lost. <laughs> That's okay though. 
It's not okay. It's okay. You win some, you lose some. I'm very upset. I'll tell you this. I'm very upset. Yeah, but you know, it's just not our year. It's okay. Maybe next year. But right now, we're going to eat Korean food with everyone. Hopefully, we make it there. You can't see us anymore, but hopefully, we make it there before it closes. Uh, it closes at 9.30, right? I have no idea. It's 8.51. Mm -hmm. It closes at 9.30. The place we're going to is Daejeong Gum Tofu House in Westlake uh, because Alicia wanted some soup. Yeah, so Hopefully we make it. Yeah. So we're gonna do that and we'll show you our food when we get inside. It's just your head. Maybe. My tofu, it's flapping. Next day now, we have Daniel with us <laughs> because today we're going to Tahoe to pick up our stuff. So we're quickly picking up some buns first. So we have food to eat on the way there. And Tony needs to get his wisdom tooth taken out. Yeah. It's hurting him. <laughs> so I think we're just gonna get Asian buns. I'm hungry. Daniel's hungry, everyone's hungry. So let's go get some buns. We got a lot of food. Oh. I think we got way too much. <laughs> too much. <laughs> we always get too much food. Okay. There's a lot of stuff. Bacon, ham, and cheese. Damn, we got With bacon, mayonnaise. ham, and cheese. Pretty good. I have this. And there's a whole bunch of stuff in here. And then also some stuff over there. Oh, <laughs> too late to show it right now. Water. <laughs> yeah, we're on our way now to Tahoe. We just stopped by this gas station to fill some gas. And I found something wonderful inside. <laughs> Look at this. These were like a thing, like what? When we were in like elementary school, which was like what, 20 years elementary, ago? Elementary, middle school. A billion years ago. And they came out with it again recently, I think. And just found it. I looked for these like, I think three months back, was it? Something like that. And I couldn't find it anywhere. We went to a couple of different Safeways. Yeah. We just found it randomly in a gas station. Exciting. I'm gonna eat it now. Do it. Oh, Are we blocking anything? No. Did you eat these when you were little? Nope, I never even know. I didn't know they existed. <laughs> this is so small. They're just. Okay, they're not as good as I remember that, Tommy. They're not? No! Like a, the of <laughs> no. They're literally just the butt pieces of the hot Cheeto puffs. Yeah, this isn't... No, the ones we had were, when we were kids were different. Yeah. Were they, were they bigger? They were in the, the little plastic cup. Yeah, in the yeah. plastic yeah. cup. The, they 3D, were, they were the 3D Doritos or Maybe we were just smaller. <laughs> maybe that's what it was. Maybe that's what it was. It's kind of like how when you... What is it? Um, I'm not mad at it actually. You bought all of the stock. All the stock. <laughs> I did bought you, it all. Did you hear the theory about tricks? Mm. Tricks? Yeah. Mm, tricks theory. 